Hey y'all, welcome back. My name is Jennifer. No eye makeup, no blush or highlighter, and no lipstick on today because we have friends. Set A from the new holiday Suku Collection 2021. I am so excited to share this with you. It is absolutely stunning. This was gifted by the brand. I always like to disclose that, but we're gonna get in to holiday set A right now. Okay guys, let's get in to this set. Let's look at the colors, the shades. Let's go look at some swatches right now. So as you can see, this beautiful holiday palette has this really pretty sparkle in it. <laughs> sparkle in it and it is the signature color eyes 110 has purples as well as a burgundy and a few neutral shades as well as a really beautiful topper there this palette is sold in a set so you have to buy all three of these items together so set a has a signature color eyes palette 6.2 grams you can see here all of the swatches they're beautiful beautiful eyeshadows. We're going to try them on here today. You have the Comfort Fluid Lip Gloss, which is 3.3 grams. This is about half the size of your normal Comfort Fluids, but the actual product is a good size, I think, and it's a really pretty, pretty shade. It's like rich and deep and just so good for holiday. I think that's going to be so beautiful on so many people. And then there's a highlighter and blush called, it's the Moon Gleam Highlighter and Blush. It's a duo. It's 5.4 grams. So here are the actual shades as well as the swatches. These look stunning. <laughs> Stunning, and I'm excited to try this blush as well as the highlighter because, oh, this cream texture is, mmm, look at this. Look at that, guys. I mean, oh, that sheen. I can't wait. So that's a little bit about the products themselves. This kit does retail for 85 US dollars right now uh, depends on the currency and exchange rates and things like that but that's what it that's what it retails for right now so Selfridges, Colt Beauty, Harrods, and Liberty London so those are the four retailers that it is being sold at and we'll get into trying it on all right y'all we're gonna begin with this beautiful palette you can see here look oh look at the sh like sparkle in here isn't it gorgeous so beautiful it's made in Japan, 12-month shelf life, 6.2 grams. I can't wait to dig in to this beautiful palette. Let's see what I'm what going to do. What are we going to do? This is like fun and just exciting. We are going to start. I have a primer down. I have the Makeup by Mario primer. I need to see if Suku has a primer because I need to try that. Um, if you've tried Suka's primer, let me know. Let's see. Let's try this shade first. It's kind of a burgundy shade. You can see here. Really pretty, huh? So we're going to put that I kind of the way I like to do rats now. I really like putting shades like this just in the corner. Like I'll stamp it, bring it in just a little bit, bring it up, and blend it out. And that's where that color is going to be. So it's not like, yeah, it's dark, it's deep, but it's just there. Does that make sense? <laughs> so I like to do, and I like using, this is a mini booster from Sonia G. Great brush for this kind of placement because the brush itself is small. I should do like tips and tricks on hooded lids. Like what brushes I use and because I have hooded lids. And you know, I found how I like to do my eyeshadow with my lids that are hooded. <laughs> so yeah, so this is what I'll do here. I'll keep it like this for just a little bit, right? Yeah. And they're sisters, not twins. I know. 
And we are going to use every shade. Yes, we are. Because I want to. <laughs> okay, let's use the Suku. Now, this is the Suku Large from, this one's from Harrods. Um, they are different if you order from Selfridges. I'm not quite sure on the differences of the brushes, but they are different. So just an FYI. Um, we're going to go in with this shade here, that one here, and see how we can just put this all over the lid. And when you blend something like this into this type of shade, it really lightens this, not as deep. You're getting something a little more soft. Look how pretty that is, guys. Wow. And I'm bringing the shade, it's so soft, the shade is, so I'm bringing it all the way up. It's easy. And that's such a beautiful shade. Oh my gosh. Suku just really brings the formulations to, I mean, they just can, they can make an eyeshadow palette, guys. I feel like they do such a great job. Chanel does a great job. And honestly, Dior. Those three are kind of like my top right now. I mean, don't get me wrong, Natasha Denona makes an amazing eyeshadow palette. Pat does too. But I feel like uh, mostly Pat's eyeshadow palettes are so big. Like this is perfect for me, personally. And it's so chic and, yeah, loving it. So see how this has blended this together really well. Got such a pretty, you could just really wear it like this and you're good. But we are not going to do that. We are going to wear it all. Let's see. Next up, we are going to, so this purple, look at that. I know, right? And this kind of like creamy, let's just swatch them all now. I'm like, I mean, look at this, guys. So pretty. But let's take, what should we do with the purple? I'm going to take the white shade and kind of, because kind of has a really pretty reflect. I mean, what? Guys, look at that. And then I'm going to take the purple and put it right here on the lid. See? That's, oh, goodness. Look at that. That's gorge. And then I'm taking the white and going to pat on top. There we go. And we are going to blend. I'm going to take this, what we used before, and I'm blending that together. I know. Do the other. Look at that shade on the lid, guys. Just beautiful. Really pretty. All right, I'm gonna add mascara in a minute. I feel like I should put something underneath though. Should I put it something underneath? Maybe, I'm wiping this brush off, the mini booster. Oh, should I use a different one? I feel like I need to. Let's see, something a little bit more tapered. Okay. Let's use a Chikahoto KZ8. So it's like this. And I'm gonna use, I think, this shade here. And put it maybe right here. Let's 
Is that enough? I don't feel like that's, you can't really see that. Hold on. I feel like I need the purple underneath. What do you think? Oh gosh. Can you see it? Well, hello. <laughs> Whoops. Don't worry, I'll clean it up. Let me clean it up. Okay, I cleaned it up. I put on a little bit more concealer under the eyes. Wow, what do we think? I gotta put on mascara, but we'll do that in just a minute because we are going to put on this. So this cheek, I gotta figure out how I want to do this. Like I think I might put it on with like a mini base brush from Sony G because it is kind of on, I don't really want to mix them, right? But I want to be able, <gasps> whoa, 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 oh yes. Guys, wow. This formula just is so, I mean, it is poor. It doesn't show your pores. It doesn't accentuate the lines because I have some lines right there. I mean, it kind of is diffusing. Like you can't, the pores are minimal, like not as big. You know, sometimes when you put on blush or something, especially a powder blush, it's kind of like, like powdery. I mean, yeah, but it doesn't sink into the skin. It kind of sets on the skin. I like something that's going to be more one with the skin. And for example, sometimes too, cream blushes will be too dewy and not sink, like sink in the skin. This is sinking in the skin. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of the um, Clay de Peau blushes. You know how the Clay de Peau um, cheek blushes that come in little pots? That's what this reminds me of. It looks so healthy, like youthful. And you know, I did put on bronzer, a powder bronzer, and it's setting over it so well. I did order the other one. I'm excited. I ordered the other set, so set B. So that's coming. Um, but I really wanted to try that too. So I'm really glad I did order it now because this is gorgeous. This is insanely beautiful. Okay, let's try this highlighter. And I'm using a Sonia G Soft Concealer Brush. And I am going to Oh, that's soft and pretty and iridescent. But oh it's natural. but not too much, not too dewy. And it sinks. Guys, it's sinking. Like, look at that. It really makes your skin look so pretty. I like this type of highlighter though. I mean, if you like a blinding highlight, this is not a blinding highlight, but it's so natural soft, natural, beautiful. Wow. This is unique, guys. If you've been on the fence about these, I would highly recommend this because it's unique. It's different. It's different than, that's different. Wow, 
Okay, let's do the lips, then we'll put on mascara and we'll close out, but uh, this is so nice. I have tried it on. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> it wears so well. Look at this shade. Y'all, it's like a brick brownie red. Hold on, I'm putting on mascara. We'll be right. All right, y'all, this is the final look. I am, whoa. <laughs> like, what? I'm, I'm very impressed, you guys. I'm super impressed. This palette is... It surprised me because it looks a lot more holiday glam than I, I don't know. I don't know what I was expecting. I, I don't know. But wow, it's glam without being too much. You know what I mean? Like the eyes pop and I love that. I love a pop. And the lip is this lip. I mean, guys. And the cheeks the skin looks really nice the i mean not accentuating pores not accentuating fine lines or wrinkles texture or anything you guys i mean the highlight is just subtle just enough well done i mean suku what on earth i'm so glad and i'm so excited i ordered set B that should be here probably next week sometime but this is a plus plus from me guys I am so thrilled about this set this holiday wow this is my first time trying it so I have to be honest it's first time trying it um I got mascara on my <laughs> so my first time trying it but I am blown away really blown away i'm really pleased with the look how it came out there are certain you know there's so many ways you can do this but i used all of the shades because i wanted to and i wanted to show y'all so yeah i hope that you guys enjoyed this thank you suku for sending this to me i really appreciate that i really do and i just adore it i really do it's so beautiful so thank you all so much for watching. I'll leave my latest video right here. And don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you there. Bye, y'all.